Paris. I don't. This one's for you. When I came to Paris, I was coming from a pretty nasty feeling place. I won't go into too much detail, but all you need to know is a girl needed to heal. A girl needed to reset. A girl needed some space. So Paris called my name. And when I came to Paris, I had three intentions to expand, create, and heal. And I can successfully say that I did all of them. But I want to say especially for healing. This was my healing era. This was my moment to really spend time with myself in a better environment, to be quiet with myself, to connect spiritually and have a more expansive outlook on life. It's changed my life being here. If you watched any of my Paris videos, and I recommend you at least watch my first week here because the most insane thing happened. I got life-changing news, a ladder fell on my foot. I was already like having jet lag initially, and then all those other things happened. It was a ride. My first time being here was a ride. First week, first two weeks at least, you know, I was healing my foot. But in turn, I was able to heal my mind and take advantage of the opportunity that was presented to me. I was able to heal the way that I intended to. When I first got here, I wanted to make so many friends. I wanted to go on so many adventures. But obviously, ooh, I don't know if you heard that, but the birds chirped really loudly and it was really cute. I wanted to obviously go expand. And I wasn't able to do that. And then I kept healing as more time went on and I kept creating all these beautiful videos. I'm so excited to keep editing. I hit all my things. I healed trauma and I keep, as each day moves on, I keep shedding that layer of myself. I reconnected and expanded universally to my guides and really letting myself be unapologetically spiritual and be unapologetically faithful. You know, I grew up in an environment with an atheist and I am creating. I am creating all my beautiful videos, my wonderful content, and I'm so happy to say that my time in Paris here has done me so good. But it's because I chose to make it good myself. I chose to come here. I chose to come here with intentions journal about it and I'm choosing to leave this chapter satiated thankful and so so grateful thank you so much thank you so much um <laughs> tingles in my nose from like emotions <laughs> and that's what this video is all about but specifically talking about the city itself it's so beautiful I, I want to take a photos every time I leave my favorite time of day is around twilight time, actually around this time right now, maybe a bit darker, when the streets and all the lights come out at night, but it's still a little bit brighter on the sky, and it's raining as it is right now, and everything is just reflecting off of everything else, and it just feels really wonderful and different to an American. That's me, I'm an American. Hi, from Oregon. Nice to meet ya. <laughs> <laughs> Was that not the most American thing that I could have possibly done? <laughs> hey, nice to meet you. I'm really, really grateful that I am, have lived in a different, an actual big city for two months. I've always been curious on what is it like to live in a big city, you know? And I finally have my answers. I finally know how I feel in a big city coming to the end of my two months. I just love taking inventory on my life, gathering this data. When I walk and I see the Eiffel Tower, because I'm close to it, I'm like, I can't believe I am so close to the Eiffel Tower um, living next to such iconic monuments like I'm so happy that I gave myself this experience um, in my life because now I've experienced it you know like I don't have to live my life wondering this time has been so introspective and healing and connective and expansive and creative all the words more importantly, I have a different outlook on my life and I've gathered my inventory. And I'm really excited for this next phase in my life. I'm excited to get grounded in England for a few more months and I hope you stick along to see the ride and watch me officially, eventually, officially move to England because that is the end goal. If you want to see my Paris adventures, 
I made a lot of beautiful videos. I mean, that's what I came here to do. I came here to create. So check out the playlist I have listed. You're beautiful and amazing, and I'm so thankful that you exist. Even if I don't know you, <laughs> I'm so thankful that you exist. Okay, bye beautiful. Ah! Holy shit! Oh my god. Sorry, I thought my shirt was inside out. <laughs> it's like, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, no, it's not inside out. Just have a different outlook. Oh, my, oh thank god, I thought that was the camera. My light just died.